Hello and welcome to my channel. CC6 will be ending soon and I'm sure some of you are wondering what the next event is. Following the event schedule from the CN server, we will be getting a new chapter addition to the main story arc. The new chapter added is chapter 9 and it's called Stormwatch. During the event duration, there will be a 7-day login event and this is all the rewards, not the best sign in rewards, but still a decent amount of LMD and other goodies. We will also be receiving a new pinecone skin at the day 7 mark, which is great. This new chapter edition introduces new materials to farm, there will be 4 new tier 3 and 4 materials added, with compound lubricant and semi-organic solvent being the tier 3 materials and pure lubricant and refined solvent being the tier 4 materials. As for why the doctor needs lubricant, we'll leave it at that. A total of 46 Originate Primes can be obtained from clearing all the Chapter 9 stages. During the event duration, all stages except Annihilation stages have a chance to drop an Emergency Sanity Sample which grants 10 Sanity when used in a Rhodes Island Supplies which grants a random material. This is great as it helps with farming for the new materials. Moving on to the exciting bits from this event, we will be getting 3 new Operators and a new Raid Up Banner. The raid up is none other than Saleach, who is a 6-star flag bearer vanguard, alongside this, Mulberry, a medic from the new archetype, wandering medic and lastly, Roberta, a supporter from the new archetype, artificer supporter. I will be making a detailed guide on all three operators as well as a should you pull video on the new raid up banner so do consider subscribing to stay tuned. Next, we will be receiving two new skins. The first skin belongs to Arketo and this skin is probably one of the most colorful skins. The next is an Astesia skin which many people are really excited about. Arketo's skin costs 18 OP and Astesia's skin costs 15 OP to buy. So if you like them, do consider buying them or they'll disappear for a long time. Alongside this, we are getting a skin rerun from the Vitafield series featuring Leonhardt, April and Our Light, Suzurin. Suzurin's and Leonhardt's skins costs 18 OP and April's skin costs 15. Next, we will be receiving a new furniture set called Victoria Guard Academy which is a limited set and will disappear after the event duration, so buy it if you like it. The total set costs 5705 furniture parts, so start saving if you want it. Lastly, we have the miscellaneous bits, there will be new permanent metal additions when the update goes live as well as new operator records, new modules for AOE medics and long-ranged snipers, new campaign and side missions. There will be a lot of good stuff coming so start saving some resources. And that is all. Hope this video was helpful in introducing the Chapter 9 Stormwatch event. I will be making similar content in the future so do consider subscribing. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.